is. <laughs> this is this is wild. Don't ask me how I even came up here to do this. Can you all hear me? Um, I hope you can. Uh, I was up here putting subtitles on my last video from last night. And I have no idea how I ended up on... Oh, I know. We, met, we saw something about a 60th anniversary in the video from last night. CERN and the Fifth Element is what we saw. And I was replying to a comment on the YouTube channel. And he said, Queen Elizabeth anniversary the 60th. So I said, well, let me... I, I checked. You all see this is how it happened. Uh, he glitched um, right here. I was reading his comment and I... Um, I responded to it and then thought, well, let me look into it more, you all. Let me look into it more. So that's what I did. And, um, oh my gosh, this is wild, you all. If you're just tuning in, this leads somewhere. This really does. Um, you're in the Roswell. Oh, singed, um, sanity. Let me, let me get my different glasses on because uh, these glasses right here, um, they're not as good. I know I'm looking kind of wild. This is not as good as this one. Okay, I got better eyesight right here. Even though they look identical, we're going somewhere. Look at this. So Queen Elizabeth, um, it's uh, like an anniversary. So what's coming up is, you know, listen, listen how they use, this is how the word ascension is used. Marking the 60th anniversary of the Queen's ascension to the throne. Okay, to the throne. All right, to the throne. So she goes to the throne. And so look at this, you all. The queen views her 1947 wedding and her 13th whatever bridal thing right here. Her bridal thing. Um, here she is right here. Um, 65 years on Britain's throne. This is the Queen, okay, but Queen Elizabeth, her, let me see this, yeah, she gave a speech on her 21st birthday, 1947, look at this, Her Majesty the Queen on her 21st birthday, 21st of April, 1947. Queen of England. I just now see something above this, you all. Who was the Queen of England, you all? This has something important if you're just tuning in. The Queen of England in 1947. What happened in the royal family in 1947? The Queen and their daughters, Prince Elizabeth and Margaret, visited South Africa. If you're in South Africa, a big shout out to you in South Africa. Why did the queen and her daughters go to South Africa in, uh, in this time? In this time, why South Africa above all the, above all the other places? Why do they want to go to South Africa? Let's look at this. They visited South Africa, making this its first time a monarch gone on a family tour together as India and Pakistan became independent in 1947, George's reign as India's emperor came to an end. I didn't know that, you all. India and Pakistan became independent in 1947 also, and the queen had to go to South Africa. Okay, that's right. Let's look at this. So um, this is what else happened in 1947. The Roswell Incident, the popular lore, now they're calling it a lore. It refers to the rumors and speculations regarding a July of 1947 United States Army Air Force balloon, Air Force balloon uh, that crashed in Roswell, you all. In Roswell, uh, following a local press interest in the debris gathered from the crash site and rumors that the debris came from a flying disc, the U.S. military stated that the crash object was merely a conventional rather balloon. Well, you know what? They would not rush out there to cover up the main story, and they wouldn't send the U.S. military out there for just a balloon. So then look what else happened. 
uh, the year the queen ascended to the throne. We got the Roswell. We have India and Pakistan. They became independent. The queen visited South Africa. Um, this is something else that happened, you all. The Dead Sea Scrolls are found. Look, discovered in 1946 and 47. It changes everything, you all. The, Jewish, the Dead Sea Scrolls are ancient Jewish and Hebrew religious manuscripts. Discovered in 1946, the queens, the caves, the mandatory... The mandatory Palestine near whatever, 1946, 47, you all. Okay, the Cold War, we got the Cold War. Look at this. Also, look at this, you all. This is really kind of interesting, too. Um, this is kind of interesting, too. So, um, look at this. The international community says yes to the establishment of Israel, 1947. The creation of Israel, a Jewish state, in 1947. Okay, we got that. We have India and Pakistan. Sorry about this. 1947. We've got Roswell. We got the Dead Sea Scrolls. Um, we have the, okay, Israel. We got Admiral Byrd going to Antarctica in 1947. The 1947 Operation High Jump. Why are all of these significant events happening in 1947? It's like the world stage turned completely. The stage and all the players, boom. It's like something new came about all of a sudden, and that was it, you all. That was it. It is all connected, you all. And if, and I just want you all to know, if you're watching this live stream as a repeat, um, they didn't allow the comments to come through. Uh, that's why you won't see very many comments on this live stream, because they did not allow it to come through. But there's something going on here. A 21-year-old woman takes the throne in 1947, gets married. They go to Africa. South Africa is what they do of all places. India and Pakistan become independent. The Dead Sea Scrolls are found. Uh, Israel is also kind of recognized in 1947. Uh, Admiral Byrd and the Operation High Jump. And um, the Cold War began. There's, there's all kinds of things happening. All kinds of things happening, and it, it's not just merely coincidence. It's all synchronicity. It's all synchronized. Everything. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, let's thank you about this. The flying panel only accepted a six-finger biometrical. Let's, let's see. Flying panel, six-fingered biometrical access in 1946. Leslie, we're going we to look at that. Yes, we are. So we're going to look at that. Uh, Victor Thomas. Let's see if we can pull that up too. Let's let me keep your comment right there. Flying panel, flying panel, flying flying panel. Let me keep this up here. Six fingered, six fingered biometric. Um, let me see if I get you one here. Uh, access biometric. I might as well say. Access 1947. Yeah, there you go. There you go. Original alien autopsy, May the 31st, 1947. A six fingered, six toes biometric access. You are right there. Um, you've got it right there. And which species has six fingers? There is a species that has six fingers. Um, alien species with six finger. If you're just tuning in, you are. So, the ancient race with six fingers and toes. Right here. Don't go so far as to think an alien race having six fingers, six toes, known as a sectodacty, hecadacty, or even is an autonomous trait. It's quite normal to occur within the human race. It's just been phased out over time. They said it's just been phased out over time. Look at that. It's phased out over time. So that's good. Anybody else got something going on with the 1947 you all? That's right. Look at this. There were ancient writings. This is the Dead Sea Scrolls too probably they're talking about. This is interesting. Often in the past, I came across ancient writings or references of people who had six digits, six fingers and toes. Sometimes 
they were seen as royalty, you all. I'm sorry about this like this, you all, but that's okay. This is a low-budget uh, YouTube video, uh, so this is not professional. Six-fingered toes, some was seen as royalty. They found ancient petroglyphs and recorded six-digited alien races, you all. Good morning. Six-finger alien races. Let's see if we can pick up a digit. Maybe not. Okay, it's like, don't tell me that they found them here in the United States. Because they could have. You never know. This will not. Oh, wow. This thing does not want me to. Let me see this linked image. Oh, they won't show the linked image. There was a linked image, and it's this is what it looks like right there. So they were often seen as royalty, and she takes the throne in 1947. India, Pakistan becomes independent in 1947. Israel, as you know, they recognize them. Um, and the Dead Sea Scrolls, 1946 and 1947. Roswell Incident, Admiral Byrd in 1947. Code War, 1947. Six finger, pimp, six finger panel biometric thing, 1947. All of it. All of it's going on, you all. There's something fishy going on. There's something uh, not of this world that is taking place is what's happening. Not of this world. Um, Gina, is there any date with the Vatican? Well, we can we can look at this. We can look at this, you all. 1947. 1947 Vatican. C-T-I-C-A-N-I. Not spelled it right, but we're going to see if it has something. Yeah, well, of course they did. They, yes, they got it. They got it. Yes, they do. This is, oh, no. This is around the same time she took the throne. It is, you all. Look at this. Mediator, look, November the 20th, 1947. Look at that. 1947, right there, you all. 1947, Vatican. Um, the Mediator, the Art in the Vatican, a controversy in... A controversy between the Vatican and the leaders of the modernistic trend in religious art remains open today despite a spectacular visit by the head of this movement. Um, let's see, anything in 1947. What? Um, I don't know. I guess something happened. I guess if we could plug in the 1947, it could be. Yeah, she took the kids. She, yes, she did take the kids. Susan B., honey, hello. So, yeah, this was her thing right here. She and her daughter, look. The queen, the royal family, and they might have had six digits on their fingers in 1947. The queen and their daughters, Prince Elizabeth, Princess Elizabeth and the Princess Margaret, they both went to South Africa. Who are they paying homage to that you all listen? The first time a monarch has gone on a family tour together. Does this make sense? Since Admiral Byrd went to the Operation High Jump, where's that at? The Operation High Jump in 1947, you all. This is a low-budget YouTube video, so don't, don't think your screen is doing it. It's low-budget. It's meant to be low-budget. Okay, so when he went to Middle Earth, he was told by the leader of Middle Earth, this has got to stop it. And what if this said leader went to the surface and he made his voice be known? And then, boom, all this other stuff just literally fell right into place after that incident happened, you all. Just what if... I've always said that South Africa, Table Mountain in South Africa, that area is the largest alien base on the planet of the Earth. It's the largest base uh, inside the Earth. Uh, wow, and I had no idea that she had went there, you all, but this all makes sense now, and there is a 60th anniversary, uh, because she ascended. I mean, she was promoted physically to the throne, uh, there was something else, you all. Let me see this like this. Um, I thought I'd seen something in November, but I don't know for sure. I don't. Let me see. Queen of England, April, you all. This is like, um, I could have had my one thing on, but um, I didn't. Um, she made a speech. I declare to you, I declare before you all that my whole life, wherever it be long or short, shall be devoted to your service and the service of our great imperial family to which we all belong. Who was she making that to? Was it just the people and or, uh-oh, 
uh, on her first birthday with her parents, um, they toured South Africa. From Cape Town, South Africa. Cape Town, South, Af South Africa is where she made that statement. Is where she made that statement in South Africa. Cable Mountain area, you all. Cape Town, South Africa. Is it the home of the Anunnaki from long ago, you all? Uh, because there is something underneath there. There is an enormous base, and I, I think it stretches all over the world. The tunnels are all over the world. That's right, you all. So hello there in South Africa. She speaks to thee. She said, ooh. She used the word six. She says, I speak to you from Cape Town. I am 6,000 miles from the country where I was born, but I am certainly not 6,000 miles from home. <gasps> oh, she's not 6,000. She says, I am certainly not 6,000 miles from home. Wow. You think she was lying? I don't think she's lying. I don't. Mm. Susan, honey, you was just on Table Mountain webcams in Cape Town. Susan. That is synchronicity, Susan, honey. Is it not? Oh, my gosh. Oh. Look, she says, my father's subjects from the oldest to the youngest, whom I do not regret, do not wish to greet. I'm thinking especially of you today and all the young men and women who are born around the same time as myself and have grown up like me in terrible. She says, in the terrible and glorious years of the Second World War. Why would you call it terrible and yet glorious? What's glorious about war? Oh my gosh. She said, let me speak on my birthday as your representative. Now that we are coming to the manhood and womanhood, it's surely a great joy, joy for all of us to think that we shall be able to take some of the burden off the shoulders of our elders who have fought and worked and suffered to protect our childhoods. Um, she said she was she's talking about the pit. She's talking about a pit, you all. I think this is an even finer thing than we done in the days of pit. Uh, we have grew up in these years of danger and glory to see that it is accomplished. So she's not, she's not 6,000 miles. I am, I am certainly not 6,000 miles from home, even though she was 6,000 miles from the country where I was born. She's, she's saying that she was born, that, born in that country, but she is calling Africa her home. Cape Town, Africa. Yes, you are. She's calling Cape Town, South Africa her home. You might say, Gina, now you're just twisting her words. No, that's exactly the way it reads. In 1947, she takes the throne. She ascends to the throne and they make a visit to Cape Town, South Africa. The Roswell crash. India and Pakistan becomes independent. Israel is recognized. The Dead Sea Scrolls are found in 1946 through 47. Admiral Byrd goes to the inner earth and the leader of the inner earth said, we're not going to have no more of this. And I think they came up and spoke there because they weren't going to have their earth destroyed. And then um, six finger, you had to have a six finger biometrical digit in order to fly. 
because y'all look let's look at this because this is this is stuff going on roswell 47 um, she is not certainly 6,000 miles from home. Um, it was the 60th um, Jubilee, the 60th anniversary, because well, the word 60th came up in the CERN and the whatever. So what is, look, the 70th anniversary as the queen in 2022. Uh, Jubilee since she ascended to the throne in 1947. And then if we look up here, um, you can see that... Um, where is it? Where is it at, you all? Well, it's not right there, you all, but look at this. So this is her speech. That's Roswell. This is the Dead Sea Scrolls. I think they had a lot of information in them in 1946. And then, boom, 47, everything starts happening. The international community says yes to the establishment. Then you have the Operation High Jump. This is a low-budget film. Then you have an original alien autopsy biometric six-fingered toes. Um, they had to give their six finger digits is what they had to do you all uh, then you have an ancient race with six fingers and toes the aliens and the uh, vatican i don't know what happened in 1947 i have no idea what happened in 1947 pope pius i don't know when he took the reign do you know when he took the reign you all because uh, I can't read that. It don't look like it's 1947. He looked like he took the reign in 1939 or something, maybe. But yeah, the queen. That's all. That's it. Mm. Look, in New Mexico, there's not a statue, but at three rivers, at three rivers in New Mexico, you can find quite a lot of interesting old petroglyphs. Several of them are showing hands with six fingers. The one in the picture seems to be reaching toward the sky with a wavy design. And can it be a snake or a flying serpent in the Milky Way? Look, I got an internal server error. Ever, a little bit of error. We can't go there, you all, but this is real. This is something happening. Someone said 19, the, the Pope wanted all the gold because the Anunnaki are coming back and they want their gold. The Anunnaki want their gold. N-A-K-I want their gold. They want their gold. And if he was a custodian for them, um, uh, the pap papacy... Yeah, what do they want from Earth? What do the Anunnaki and the ancient Sumerians want? <sighs> the Vatican is preparing to introduce... Look at this, 19... Look at this, uh, September of 2014. The Vatican is preparing to introduce the Anunnaki to us. Click it, click. Oh, my goodness gracious, you all. Oh. <laughs> Oh, they're turning up the heat on the mundane aspects. Um, he's preparing to introduce... Um, oh. Extraterrestrial. This is in 2014. They are not far from establishing the first contact given the advances made in astronomy um, and the Holy Scripture. In the Holy Scripture, you all... Could it be aliens, a missing plane, conspiracy abound? Mm. Look at this. Uh, NASA Library of Commerce, uh, Astrobiology Symposi Symposi Symposium, uh, the approach to the impact of finding a microbial complex of intelligent life beyond Earth. Um, the Vatican... Right here, you all, the Vatican, um, NASA, Library of Congress chair, um, the extraterrestrial. He says the, they portray the aliens as good guys with the congruence stating that he will baptize an alien. And Foon states, the extraterrestrial is my brother. It's his brother, you all. It's the, uh, oh, Oh. 
I don't know what this stuff is, you all. I don't. Uh, you know what I can do, though? Since I opened all of this stuff up, I'm going to... When this video ends, I'm going to take all these links and I'll put it in the description of these videos. That way you know everywhere that we went. Okay, everywhere that we went. But that's all I wanted to say is that the queen, she um, went to the throne in 1947. And they immediately went to South Africa. Cape Town, South Africa, the place of Table Mountain. The largest alien extraterrestrial base on the planet. Um, that's what it is. The largest base on the planet, you all. Table Mountain, South Africa. It, it really is. I had a, ooh, I have a really good video. Oh, you all, let me, let's, let's look at this. I'm going to take you over here to my channel. Because there is a really good video about Table Mountain. You can see the ship. Of course, on that, on this channel right here, of course on this channel, um, I've got a Table Mountain, you all. I've got a Table Mountain playlist. Um, let's see if we can find the Table Mountain playlist. Because I had a lot right here. Table Mountain, South Africa. I have 41 videos on Table Mountain, South Africa, where the queen went. It started off with plasma. And um, then the Table Mountain, South Africa live webcam. We could see the ship, the, uh, the great big ship, you all. I'm not joking. The Anunnaki ship. And then look at this one, you all. You can see in this mountain right here. This was a really good one. Let me move this to the top. Boom. You see this right here? Let me, let me, let me show you this. This is, look, you can see this is the Table Mountain, you all. This is what showed up during my uh, viewing of Table Mountain, South Africa, Cape Town. Look at the mountain. The mountain is cloaked. It is a great big massive complex where the extraterrestrial lives are. I know I, I shouldn't have been doing it. This is a low budget film if you're just watching. This is Table Mountain. Cloaked. Cloaked. Cloaked, Susan, honey. Cloaked. You all go to my Table Mountain playlist on this YouTube channel. It's going to show up like that because I put that at the forefront. At the forefront, I've, I've documented many UFOs there. I have. Many UFOs have been documented at Table Mountain. I apologize for my low budget thing. Table Mountain UFO was ground based. They are going in the, they're going into the ground, you all. The mountain moves also. There's a secret entrance in the mountain. This mountain literally. You see how it's sticking up right there? Parts of the mountain. Um, went like that. Parts of the mountain went like that, you all. How on earth did I get into... How did... Okay, I'm dancing on Table Mountain. It's got some other things on here, you all. I'm dancing at Table Mountain. If you like to see me dance, I'm dancing at Table Mountain. It may not be a normal plane. There's a really good video right here. The Golden Ship. In Cape Town, South Africa, you all, this is really dramatic. This is the um, time-lapse footage, and a golden ship appears at the top of Cable Table, Table Mountain in South Africa. If you're on here from Cape Town, South Africa, and you're seeing Gina Honey on here, hello from Gina Honey, from my heart to yours. Um, you got a very um, spiritual place there, a very um, sacred place place there and there's a lot of um extraterrestrial activity in cape town with the queen going there you all and she admitted that it was her home she's not certainly six thousand miles from home she's not right there in 1947 1947 at on her 21st birthday Boom. She will be devoted to the service of the great imperial reptilian family to which we all belong. That was my words. I don't want to put words in her mouth. I really don't. Mm. Yeah, that's, that's about it. I'm done. And six fingers. We got six fingers and stuff, you all. We do... Yeah, yeah, so, um, 
six fingers and it it just may be everybody's imagination all of it we are all just imagining things you all every one of us um, yeah but it was it was um, that's copying her she's declaring it the Roswell the Dead Sea Scrolls Israel wash yeah um, Operation High Jump, and I apologize again. The original autopsy, uh, six fingered, six toes, ancient race. Um, uh, Pope Pius was there at that time. We're talking about the Elohim, and then we're talking about Table Mountain, South Africa, right there. I've done sad enough, you all. This is Table Mountain, I kid you not. Table Mountain, and we found it during the live streams. Well, I would, I would record it. This is how this is how much time I put in it. I go to the live streams and I would record it, um, and then I would save the video and I would literally go frame by frame. If there was twenty frames in one second, I would do that to a two-hour-long video, and it showed up just like that. So I'm going to go, you all. I am, and uh, thank you for watching this. And I really do encourage you to go look at. Um, some of those Table Mountain videos, especially the one on the playlist, and this is not all a coincidence. Too many things happened in 1947. It literally was like a changing of the guards, a changing of the guards, a changing of the players. Something was put into motion, all is like, like that, you all. It was. So, thank you again. And uh, please give this video a thumbs up, you all. Uh, hit that like button, that give it a Oh, I already said that. Well, hit that subscribe button, you all. Yeah. Oh, you're so welcome, Susan, honey. That's right. Oh, Dee Dee Lynn, honey, that's okay. Gina, honey, says hello to you. Yeah, so I'm going to go. And with that being said, hello, wherever you are in any part of the world. Hello. From my heart to yours, love you. Have a wonderful rest of your day. And again, I apologize um, for doing this uh, B-rated um, video on my cell phone because I do have... I have professional equipment, but um, this is a spur of the moment, and you can see I've got my, oopsie, I got my big computer here and stuff like that, and I got my stream deck and things like that, you all. So yeah, I'm going to go. I'm going to go, you all, and I'm, I will. As soon as I end this video, I'm going to keep all these windows open, all these tabs that are at the top, right up here, and uh, I'll put them in the description of the video so you know every single place that we went. Gotcha. Love you.